Courtney Noel and today I'm going to be reviewing for you my new Love Me Hair wig. It's currently on my head. So just as a quick backstory, I've never worn a wig before in my life. I am just about my hair being super easy to use. So usually I straighten my hair and then I just can curl it at nighttime and I go about my day. But I am trying to put a little less heat on my hair so that I can grow it. So I wanted to go to a protective style. We are currently still in the pandemic and I am in the LA area so I can't see my hairdresser. So getting a weave and other protective hairstyles is just not in the cards for me. So that's why I went ahead and got a wig so that it could be super easy. And I had heard that these were really easy to install, especially for girls that have never worn or women that have never worn a wig before. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the unboxing of this and the whole process of how I got from the box to this look. All right, so keep watching. Okay, so I just got this in the mail and I'm really excited to open it up and see what it looks like. <laughs> We're stepping up our game here, guys, and doing it with two hands. So as you can see, so I'm in the process right now of just making my hair grow out more. So I'm looking for protective styles. So that's why I went ahead and got this. It says, enjoy your hair journey from now on. So let's. So this is the actual wig itself. And then, ooh, I love it. I got a hot comb, which I use all the time. And I love that this one is a plug-in one. So I'm all about having a plug-in hot comb. And then these are all the different headbands because I got the headband wig. And these are all the things that I need for putting it on. And it has wig cap. Okay, so now let's open up the actual wig itself. So, <laughs> bag. And I got the curly haired one. So, this is it. Ooh, I love it. It's curly hair, it's pretty long. This is the length. Really nice. Okay, so first take your natural hair and put it into a braid. Now my hair was already straightened, which is why it's straight, but you can definitely do this when you have just washed your hair, which is what I plan to do in the future. But just either make one French braid or do little side braids and then put your wig cap on. Now this is me taking my wig out of the bag. Now I keep my wig in this bag, that's what they tell you to do. And I also make sure that I keep it in the netting that it came in as well because this is a 20 inch wig. So I definitely want to be able to preserve it as much as possible. So all I do is I make sure that there's no kinks or knots or anything. I brush out this wig every night before I put it in the bag. And you can see that it has these two elastic straps in the back. So I just hook it on the back. There's a little hook back here. So I just put the hook underneath the wig cap and then pull it down in the front. And you'll be able to feel this when you're doing it. And then what I do is I just kind of put all my hair up in a little bun just to get it out of the way so that I can reach those two elastic straps in the back and hook them together. And you don't have to put your hair up to do this. You can definitely just swoop it to the side, but I find that it's easier if you have a clip or something to attach these two pieces in the back. And as I mentioned, there's a little clip right there that I hooked into the back of my head. And then there's also one little hook in the front. So that's where I'm adjusting to try to pull it and get it hooked to the wig cap. And then there's two other little hooks on the side. Now, I didn't have a mirror when I was doing this, so I couldn't see how far to pull the wig down, which is why you can still kind of see my wig cap. But don't worry, we're going to cover it up with the headband. And again, you'll be doing this in a mirror so you can see. Okay, so now this is one of the headbands. I just kind of put it over and then just slam it on my head like that. And you can see it doesn't move when I do hair flips and things. You can put it in different styles if you want to, half up, half down, and I'll talk about that more. All right, guys, so we are done. It was super simple. You saw what I did. I literally just slammed it on my head and then put the headband on. So it took less than two minutes to do. And um, I just popped off screen really quickly so that I could see a mirror to pull it down. That was the only thing that I did. So again, you don't need any glue. You don't need anything. It just sits on your head very securely. So I'm loving this so far. It is great. You can also style it a bunch of different ways. So you can like do half up, half down if you want. You can do a full pony if you want. 
you can do like a whole bun situation if you're just trying to throw it up to do a workout or whatever it doesn't move so it's very versatile and again I have no hairstyling like experience ability this is my first wig so it's super easy to use so if you're interested just click the link below and it will take you to their website to purchase it also I am going to be getting a discount code, so just go ahead and send me a message and I will let you know what the latest discount code is for you to get a discount on your hair. So I'm here for you guys. So I hope that you enjoyed this. I hope that this was super helpful. Please let me know in the comments if there's anything else you want to know about the wig and I'm happy to message you and give you more information. And I know that this is a fitness channel, but I do also cover a lot of lifestyle things. So that includes beauty, hair, and travel. So make sure that you hit the subscribe button so you can see all the things that I have to offer. I'm more than just a trainer. I'm actually a personal trainer who shows you my whole lifestyle outside of the gym. So when you subscribe to my page, you're going to get gym things, you're going to get workouts, you're going to get nutrition, and every other part of my life, which is includes my hair care and my beauty and skincare regimen. So lots to see. So make sure that you hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for future videos. See you then.